peace and purpose. And it's just to hopefully inspire women to know that no matter what, right, to embrace all of their story, the good, the bad, the ugly things we don't want to talk about, embrace the fact that it is all to prepare you, to propel you to a greater place in life. Now, I know you, we've talked in the past and Mm -hmm. we talked about embracing the ugly. Is there planning and controlling? It was like, I'm going to have this thing. Like, I'm going to have this. I'm going to experience this before I die. And it just went way wrong. (laughs) Um, But that was a learning experience. And I needed all of that to appreciate where I am now and to get me to where I am, to finally get to that end of the rope, if you will, as, you know, this dark place to say, okay, God, like, I can't fix this. I don't know what to do and move out of the way. The way and in God's way of what he really had for me, trying to fix what wasn't meant for me and staying stuck way longer than I should because I didn't love myself enough. And so this journey, which I share in my book, is going through that and where I had to kind of reflect where that came from, like, Why was that so important? And where did that come from when I grew up with my dad, loving my mom like he did, that set to nurture ourselves mentally, spiritually, emotionally, right? When when we don't do that, we're not our best selves. We're not showing up as good as we may tell ourselves we are, if we're Mm -hmm. truly honest, right? When you're when you hit the your head hits the pillow at the end of the night, like do you have regret? Do you have dread when you wake up? Like all of that is because we're not paying attention to our bodies. We're not loving ourselves first and how much better you are when you do that. And somebody needs it now. Like I felt like in my intro, literally I say, I apologize to my reader for the delay because I don't know whose breakthrough I sat on because I wasn't doing what God told me to do. I sat on my gifts and gifts are meant to be given, right? Like this didn't happen just for me. And so I delayed someone, I mean, God's on time, right? He knows how to adjust it. But whose breakthrough I delayed by...